In MicroStation, you do not have to save your design changes. MicroStation uses a write to disk method for storing your work rather than in your computer's memory. MicroStation immediately saves design changes as they are made in the active model. However, prior to closing a design file or opening another, you may also want to save the design file settings. For example, when Save Design File Settings is invoked, the location of a dialog on the view, as well as what tool or symbology, level, color, style, weight, priority, transparency, and template that's active and any user preferences are saved to the active design file. In addition, you can compress a design file, which permanently removes deleted elements from the file. In this lesson, you will close a file or design session, interact with recent files, save settings, modify user preferences, compress a design file. Continuing in MicrostationBasics.dgn, in the Precision Input with AccuDraw model, ensure that some newly created elements are visible. You will close this DGN file and reopen it to see what happens. Select File, and from the Backstage, select Close. This returns you to the work page. The last open file is now listed in the Recent Files list. This list is used to display a history of the files that were opened from a particular workspace and workset combination. Click on the MicrostationBasics.dgn file to reopen it. The file is opened again, however a different model is displayed than the one you are working in. That's because you did not save the design file settings, but don't worry, the newly added elements are automatically saved. Open the models dialog by clicking the models icon on the Home tab in the Primary Ribbon group. In the list of models, double-click the Precision Input with AccuDraw to open it. The elements you created earlier in this model are visible again. Select Save Settings in the Quick Access Toolbar, or press Ctrl F, to save the current design file settings of the design file. Close the design file and reopen it. This time, the Precision Input with AccuDraw model is immediately opened. By default, design changes are automatically saved, but design file settings are not. If you want to change these preferences, Click on the File tab, then on the Backstage select Settings, User, Preferences. In the Preferences dialog, select the Operation category. Check or uncheck the Save Settings on Exit and the Auto Save Design Changes Preferences. User preferences are not stored in the DGN file. Instead, for portability purposes, they are stored in a separate user preferences file. Note, in all changes, it is best practice to have autosave design changes set to on and save settings on exit set to off. Design changes should be automatically saved to reduce data loss rather than waiting until the end of a design session to save your changes. You should implicitly save settings as needed. This allows you to save just the desired settings. By waiting until the end of a design session, it is possible that settings may get saved that you do not want to permanently change. Before archiving a DGN file, it is a good practice to compress it. Compressing a DGN file reduces the size by purging deleted elements. It also clears the undo buffer, so you will no longer be able to undo and redo during the active session. On the Quick Access Toolbar, select Compress Options. In the Compress Options dialog, leave all options unchecked and click Compress. Click on the File tab and then select Close to close MicrostationBasics.dgn. In this lesson, you learn to close a file or design session. Interact with recent files, 
save settings, modify user preferences, and compress the design file. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.